What I'm going after is our habits, our spiritual, emotional, and mental habits, because we can have a breakthrough. We can understand something. Maybe it's in a message. Maybe it's in your own devotional time. Maybe it's Renew Ministry. Maybe it's talking through, you know, somebody's giving you wise counsel. And all of a sudden, the truth smacks you in the forehead like a Mack truck. And you think, okay, that's it. This is the thing. That's it. If I just hold on to this, then I will experience freedom and I can walk in freedom. And then what do you do? Maybe you're not like me, but this is like this happens sometimes to me. I'll get a truth, hit me smack dab. Yep, that's the thing. I need to hold on to it. And then what do I do? I thank God for it. I'm like, God, you're so good. I appreciate that. And then what happens? We drop it, right? Okay, that's fixed. And then we walk away. Guys, you cannot leave your garden unattended. The weeds will grow. The same old thoughts can just come rushing back in. And we can think, man, the same old thought patterns, the the habits, the emotional things that we are just so used to doing, that muscle that we keep flexing. And so when it doesn't work out, well, then shame comes rushing in yet again. It's like, okay, great. Well, I guess I didn't change. I'm not any different. I'm just the same old schmuck that I've always been. I guess counseling doesn't work. Prayer doesn't work. Green Bible doesn't work. I should just stop trying. I guess I'm just stuck in this awful place, hopelessly destined to not changing. Ever been there? I mean, come on. You don't have to raise your hands. But I know that's like all of us in this room. I know I'm speaking to everyone here. That's a miserable place. Now, time out for a second. Pause. What did we just do? Well, what did I just do? You didn't do it. I did it. What did I just do? Go through all that stuff that, oh, I guess this isn't, this doesn't work. I'm still a schmuck. What is that? It's complaining. I just complained. And not only that, but the complaints, pretty much everything I said, they're all lies. They're not true. Do you see that the vast majority of the complaints in your life are not real? Just, I'm just the same old schmuck. No, you're not. Prayer doesn't work. That's not true. Counseling doesn't work. That doesn't, that's, that's not true. I'm stuck. False. This is hopeless. I'm destined to be miserable. All of it. It's untrue. Do you see? (laughs) No wonder it makes us miserable. And what I want to present to you today is that that miserable place is very often, almost always something that you choose. 